a multi award winner. Is it a multi award winner? Woo! Never out of the papers. Woo! As seen on TV. Woo! Personal friend of Trevor McDonald. <laughs> Would you please welcome to the stage? We're very honoured. Let's get a ripple of applause going. Very low. Very low. Very low. Very low. Very low. She's following your cause of success. She's swinging into action. Here she comes over the stage. Miss B. Number two, the owl monkey. 
mosquito. Number three, the spider monkey. Number four, the blue monkey. And number five is the olive baboon. I don't know what he tastes like. <laughs> number six, the yellow baboon. And number seven, the sea monkey. Although they're not really monkeys. <laughs> they're shrimps. Do you know, sometimes I don't always love monkeys. Like when one stole my water bottle in Thailand. And another one pinched my sunglasses in Portugal. And the final straw was when they broke my windscreen wipers at Whipsnake. <laughs> <laughs> the Wizard of Oz monkey. You know those ones with wings? They scared me, I didn't like them. Planet of the Apes. What's that about? <laughs> and that 70 TV show, The Monkeys, there weren't even any monkeys. <laughs> spider monkeys, they're a bit scary because they remind me of spiders. And the other thing I don't really like is, you know, when the astronaut monkeys landed on Earth, mostly they died. Oh. And that's not happy exactly. And the other thing is about monkeys in space is I haven't been to space. <coughs> so I think it's very unfair. <laughs> that's monkey jealousy. <laughs> so um, that's not very nice. I don't like that at all. That's not very good. And um, well, I want to tell you a few more facts because I don't think you've learnt enough about them. <laughs> The proboscis monkey, the average male, travels about two kilometres for food. A bit like the average 18-year-old male at a McDonald's drive. <laughs> and the proboscis monkey male communicates using grunts, snorts and honks. A little bit like the average 18-year-old male at a McDonald's drive. And finally, the bachelor proboscis monkeys, they all go around in bachelor groups, and they do genuinely have permanently erect penis. A bit like <laughs> But you know, life isn't all great as a proboscis monkey before you go out there and decide to be one. One little piece of sugary fruit, acid build up in their stomach, and they die. Oh. Death by farting. <laughs> Worst ways to go. Well. <laughs> howler monkey. Uh, there's another one up for howler monkey, which is. Oh, the red Columbus monkey. <laughs> How could I forget about him? And there's plenty of monkeys, but did you know that the pygmy monkey is the smallest one? It's so cute. And then there's the grease monkey. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure which part of Greece. <laughs> what do you call a monkey? Lost. <laughs> what do you call a monkey in the North Pole? Cold. <laughs> what do you do if you see a blue monkey? Make him smile. <laughs> Which side of the monkey has more hair? The outside. <laughs> <laughs> Do if you were in the jungle and a gorilla charged you, pay him. <laughs> <laughs> and what did the monkey say who chopped off his tail? It won't be long now. <laughs> <laughs> and I want to leave you on a poem that I made up <coughs> all by myself. Monkeys are red, monkeys are blue. If you were a monkey, I would love you. Thank you very much.